What's up my shopping friends, my name is Remy Kiwi Bo and today I'm coming at you with another overview. Like always, the, this video does contain dull nudity, so if you are sensitive to that type of thing, one, you have been warned, and B, if you're very sensitive to that type of thing, please click off the video. Anyways, um, today I will be I will be overviewing my repaint for Laguna from Scary Reef. So um, I don't tell you so long. Eh. Alrighty then. So um, this one is going to be yeah. I'm not gonna make it quicker. Yeah, I'm gonna go into every detail as possible. So start off with the face. Um, actually, first off, I did straighten her hair, so, you know, you, you don't normally see, again, you don't normally see, um, fishes with, um, tied up hair, especially mermaids. So, um, I put a lot of detail into her, even though she is a quite simple repaint, I did do a lot of detail. Um, actually, uh, with her varnish... I actually wanted her to have that little kind of wet glow to her, so, um, although she is quite sticky, so I might have to do my little technique. Okay, I'll show you what I do when I do kind of like a video of some sort. So, I wanted kind of like this little bit here yeah, to match kind of the rest of the body, which is what I'm going to get to do now. Let's just move her arms. Now, moving on to the top half of her. Now, I wanted it to be kind of like a blue going into kind of like... A, she's she's pretty much like an ice mermaid, really. So, what I did was I kind of painted kind of the sides with them. I think um, the paint I used was almond blue, I think it was. Uh, by the actual colour, I think it was almond blue. And then what I did was I did kind of like... Um, I dry brushed in layers, in very thin layers, I dry brushed... Um, white so it kind of transitions and I think it does did a nice little texture and done nothing to the actual tail itself but it does look like a moustache yes <laughs> but um there was just um, as you know these this is Laguna blue and um just a side note with all of the scary reef dolls they do all glow in the dark they do have um bits of them that do glow in the dark with um, Frankie and part of Perry, it's their kind of hip fins. With Laguna, it's her wings. So her wings are her purpose of actually glowing in the dark. Which I think is really, really cool that they did kind of like a glow in the dark thing with um, these. Because obviously, you know, fishes glow. You can see I'm not really believing that, but... I think it's really, I think it's pretty cool, yeah, that they made them kind of glow, because it's, re it's really nice at night time. Because you have, like, you know, they're there. It's kind of creepy. Anyways! So, um, oh yeah, that's right, I forgot to, um, do the timings. Um, all of them took about, maybe, two days to repaint. Uh, due to the fact of straightening hair, when you put the hair dry, then repainting it, then doing the body, and stuffy, stuffy, stuff like that. Um, so they all took about two to three days to paint, apart from one of them that took a few days, like maybe a week, to repaint. Um, this one took about, I would say two and a half days. Because of waiting for this paint to dry, even though they dry quite quickly, I want to make sure yeah, that it's all dry. So, and second, I have to varnish them as well. So, this is Laguna. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, I'm not taking that out. I'm keeping that there. What a hard. I can speak today. It's funny, since this is the only video I actually fucked up with. <laughs> so, start again. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, I enjoyed making it, and as always, I will see you in, actually by the time this video is uploaded, it'll be Q&A day, or I'll be recording Q&A, so yeah, 
I will see you guys in the Q and A video on Thursday. Wait a minute, I don't know. I don't even know which one I'm going to be uploading first. I'll see you in the next study video. Stay plastic.